What's up, folks? Welcome back to another edition of Truck Thoughts. I kind of feel human again, so sorry about missing uh, last week on any updates or thoughts that I've had uh, and not being on the show. As you can hear, my voice still isn't 100%, but it's way better than it was. Anyway, on to the thoughts. The thoughts are on yesterday's game. Obviously, we got a win, which was great. We needed that win. No big deal there. Well, big deal there, because had we lost... It would have been far worse. But that win kind of feels like you just beat up on your little brother in a sense of like playing pickup game of basketball with a little kid. You better win, but wow, you just beat a little kid. That kind of sense. But I will say this, uh, you got a win, and on that day you were able to run for over 100 yards in one player uh, in Cordell Patterson, which, man, great to have him back. And your defense only gave up one touchdown. What I'm getting at here is you finally had a game where you won and you were able to survive a mediocre showing from Matt Ryan. Up to this point, you were only able to win with a Herculean effort from Ryan. Now you're able, like not able, but now you pulled off a win that was a mediocre showing from Matt Ryan. So I call that improvement, and it's improvement that I like to see because at the end of the day, you can't just rely on one player. You have to have a complete team. Now, we obviously don't have the roster to compete, and if we do find ourselves stumbling into the playoffs, I imagine that we'll get smoked pretty quickly. But what I am liking to see is the fact that we have five wins now, which is one more than last year. A few of those wins probably would have been losses last year. So, yes, this coaching staff hasn't been perfect, and neither has this team, but you are starting to see some improvements. You're also seeing a coaching staff willing to admit its mistakes, such as having Dahlman switch out with Hennessy. I hope that continues, because Hennessy has been a liability all all season. So now if we can just get the wide receiver core to do something, um, whether it's Kyle Pitts, who some of y'all are considering a bust, which – We'll get into that on Wednesday because that's ridiculous. But either way, it's a win, and it's a win you had to have. A, to stay relevant in the playoff hunt. B, to be second in the NFC South. But more importantly, to show that you can win even on a mediocre game from Matt Ryan. That's my truck thoughts. We'll see you all on Wednesday.